a method. So, um, a message means you follow certain aspects or rules which will undo with that mess because it's a message. It's a certain things we have to do here. If we don't do it, the outcome will be not right. Polishing with um, where is it? You know, I'm thinking of um, yeah, some anything. Take something uh, like uh, knitting. <laughs> I love to knit gloves, and um, if you don't know how to do it, that is a method. If you don't take the instructions of your mother or some teacher, you don't, you are in the fog and with your kind of thoughts about it and it will, will need on your part then maybe patience and uh, trying out, but if you have now a good method, you will go with greater ease about it. Hmm? So, and here you have, men. there are methods coming through our uh, practicing and engaging this kind of faculty mind investigation and uh, you can be lucky that it has this they you have such a practice because in each little step forward uh, you uh, it, you you can delight in there is some change in that what we want actually to accomplish, to be more free from the influx of the disturbances. You call it dukkha or suff that is suffering. That's, this is whatever we do here in that on the past. It is always fulfilling something or completing lessening and that is uh, this suffering that is uh, we cannot allow it in the way where I am not doing anything and forget have forgotten is an enormous healing power functioning with each breath it comes and the deeper and the more flowing you allow that breath you will be able uh, to uh, receive the finer, finer energy of the breath. Breath is what is breath. It's a function and the movement of air. The more you get into it, you get finally also to hit, to get that spark where the finest, finest energy of the so-called press is discovered, experienced and allowed. Some of the more fullness at the moment is allowed. You got what you wanted. It's healing. But everything what we are doing is actually in that direction. Reducing the suffering. So it has to be healed. darkness has to be lit up. Only one little candle or so one little flame is already dispersing the darkness. One little more of patience, of investigation, of trusting myself, humbleness, letting go disappointment, dissatisfaction. I cling not to well-being in pain and sorrow am I not perturbed, even minded in all chances that is our path.
it's clean.